morning everyone we got the new rats in the game finally um these two you know i've been wanting the flea bitten dapple gray what i've been wanting the flea bitten english thoroughbred ever since i saw it this picture is really nice though like the arabian looks beautiful here even though in the spoilers i was like nope i ain't getting it and then we got new feathered friends dude that is such a funny wording anyway we'll check these out um i want to tell you guys something look at me notice anything different i finally got the um racing tack i finally built reputation with the regal um silver glade racetrack thing and i could get my hands on this tack and i'm so happy with it i know it's not a full set you know i should be getting and i should be having the the gloves and the boots but the thing is that I feel like it looks better with the boots that I have now. If I have these ones, it's like way too much. It's way too much blue and it feels very forced in a way. And it's funny because in Star Stable we dress up very matchy and it's not really realistic because in real life people, you know, people do this but not so often. Um, also, there's this other set with the green saddle pad that is really nice. Now, the only problem I have is that it's really expensive, so then. I'll just stick with the blue one for now. Okay, let's go to... Let's first feed my horses. That's what I always do, do to my videos. The first thing I do just feed my rats. Um, and then, you know, go ahead and buy the new thoroughbred. I'm really excited for it, dude. Oh, look at this new Pasofino. I don't like this one. Dude, as soon as I said that, it just disappeared. I do be offensive, I guess. You guys have no idea how happy I am that I got my hands on this Pasofino and this one before they went away you know i'm going through this pretty weird phase everyone knows me for having black paints and i'm starting well not to dislike the paints the black paints but i'm going through a phase and i'm like do i even like them as much as i used to like for example i look at this pasofino that is obviously a black paint and it's beautiful but the battle in my mind right now is between whether or not i like dapple grace more than black paints and for the longest time, people have known me for liking black paints more than anything. And now I'm like, okay, but dapple grays might be, might be a bit more beautiful. You know what I mean? I'll let you know once I know whether or not I like dapple grays more than black paints, which I think is true. And I'm just trying to lie to myself that that's not the case because everyone knows me for liking black paints and paints in general. I, I went through so many phases, man. When I first got into horses in 2015, palominos used to be my thing. I used to adore palominos. Right now, I think palominos are my least favorite horses when it comes to coats. Um, I used to really, really like paint horses and like Sabino horses. And now I'm like, I don't like them that much, really. They're nice, but I don't see them as I used to see them. You know what I mean? Like my taste has changed a lot when it comes to coats. Okay, so here we have the chestnut one. You know, it's beautiful, but something about it just makes me not want to buy it, man. I don't know if it's the mane and the tail color, and there's nothing wrong with it. Or maybe the coat is a bit too orange for me, I don't know. But man, this one. Okay, the eyes do be kind of creepy. But it's probably because it's, you know, from the older generations. I mean, it's not an older generation, it's an older style. Because if you look at the Pasofino, which is a generation 3 horse, and you look at the English Thoroughbred, which is also a generation 3 horse, you can see a lot of improvement on the Pasofino because over time, um, despite the fact that they're both, you know, generation 3 horses, it looks different, you know, it does look different, the Pasofino looks way better because the technique that the artists have used and are using now, is, you know, are obviously better, more improved, and that's why they look different even though they're both generation 3 horses, and the eyes, I don't like the eyes, but I like the thoroughbred overall anyway. You know, I kind of hate the fact that we have to name our horses something like this. Like, I wish I could name my horse whatever I would want, and I wouldn't be constricted like this. But I get it, you know, this is a kid's game, you can't name your horse. I was gonna say something that I shouldn't say. You know, I have a horse named Mouse, but this one does look like a mouse, man. My voice cracked really bad. What if I named it Mouse Bell? Like, it's a beautiful mouse. You know what I mean? Guys, I've been trying to pick a name for the past 10 minutes. I'm just gonna name it Horse Horse. I have no name ideas. And I wanna check out the horse. So I'll just name it Horse Horse. 
I woke up like an hour ago and I'm already at my second coffee. I'm not right. There we go. Um, we also have the new feathered friends. Yeah, so I'm not gonna be getting the chestnut Arabian. Guys, if you don't have this horse, then buy it. It's literally the best Arabian. Okay, where are the feathered ratatouille rats? They might get more limbs, so let's travel there. Okay, why is there only one? And I don't like it. It's weird that it has the same color as my tack. Dude, these balloons are so ugly. Why would you even buy a freaking balloon and spend 350 Starbucks? What? <laughs> I said, why did I say Starbucks? Why would you spend 350 star coins on this? Anyway, where is the other one? I liked the other one more. Where is the other one? Bruh. That is new. I like that for some reason. Is it here? Oh, here it is, dude. Dude, I'm so dumb. Oh, it costs spring tokens. Well, it's... it's okay. Let's go ahead and check out my new horse. You know, just because I got this thoroughbred doesn't mean I'm gonna train it. Not now, though. How do I have only 4,000 star coins when I literally just bought star coins? Like, what did I do with my star coins? That's the question. Like, what horses did I buy? I bought a Welsh pony? I bought one of the new... I mean, not new, one of the... Um, horses that are gonna leave Star Stable forever. Also, I never mounted on that horse. Like, I made a whole video about it. And I never touched that horse. This one, Tooth. I'm literally sick in the head. I bought this horse, and I forgot about it. Like, a while recording. I was just like, I bought it, and then I was like, Okay, guys, thanks for watching. Have a good one. And then I also bought this one, baby. So I have bought this one, I bought this one, I bought this one, I bought this one. I bought this one. I bought this one. Okay, I did buy a few horses with those star coins, so they didn't just go to waste. And I also bought this new tack, which is really expensive. Did where on earth is the thoroughbred? Um, does it look a lot like like Starshine? So this is horse horse, and then this is Starshine. No, they are different, but this one is way better. Let's first get on this horse that I never touched, dude. I literally bought it, I made a video about it, and I never mounted on this horse, which I think is really weird. Yeah, okay, that was enough. That was more than enough. I'm never gonna touch this horse again. Dude, it looks amazing with this tack. You know what's weird when you walk with the, with the thoroughbreds? Look at the way the... Like, I know this might sound weird, but... Look at the way the tail looks. It's positioned wrong. At least it looks like it's positioned in the wrong place. Like it's more to the right or to the left when you change angles like this. When you look from the profile side. And then the butt, like the butt cheeks look very weird, like clay almost. Very anatomically incorrect. <laughs> And then this is the trot, which I think is really nice. Dude, the only thing I dislike about this horse is the eyes of it. I really dislike those. And this is the canter. Yeah. Well, we know the animations of this horse. Have they changed the hard stop like a bit? Like it looks a bit different. Like it's more swift now. I feel like. Something about it feels different. The river is the same, walking back is the same. Okay, let's change the hairstyle, get the braids, because you guys know I cannot stand the default main style on my horses for some reason. But for some reason I don't like the braids that much. No, I do actually. But I'm not gonna get them. I'm not gonna get them. Um, I spent way too much star coins, not that like 19 star coins or 17, how much it is to change the hairstyle. But change a lot but still yeah, it's a nice horse i'm happy about it i'm not training it though anytime soon i have other horses to train the pasofinos for example they're the best and a lot of people ask me what happened to my pasofino after uploading my last video when buying them and no they did not go away i still have them as you can see and when i reviewed the horses i was next to the buying horses thing and i couldn't show you guys this animation which is the best when you press space 
It's got this special animation and movement, and it's so awesome and funny. I really like it, dude. <laughs> I kept calling it the Pasofinos Lusitanos in my video, dude. I was not okay. Um, but someone made me think that they're Lusitanos. They kept saying that they're Lusitanos um, in my DMs. I think that's why I kept calling them Lusitanos. <laughs> Yeah, no, but they're the best, dude. Oh, they changed the animation, the backing up animation. It wasn't like this. I'm just... I feel like it wasn't like this, right? They said they would make changes to it, and... If you look back to my video, they did not move like this. Have they changed the walk? I feel like they've, they've changed a few things. Like, the back legs don't look as... Okay, when, when you can't turn, it looks bad. Like when you trot and when you walk, the back legs look better now. I might be wrong. I might be wrong. They still need a lot of work. Um, because because look how elastic the skin looks like and the back legs. Look at that. That looks really bad. But they're gonna change that for sure. And then when you hard stop, nothing new here. I don't like this movement. I don't know why. It just makes me a bit uncomfortable. Yeah, anyways guys, that was it for today's video. Um, let me know if you bought the Arabian or if you bought the new Thoroughbred, what you think of them. And if you guys want to buy my merchandise, there's a link in my description. If you want to become a patron and support me, you can do that. There's a link in my description box for that. Um, and if you want to subscribe, ring the bell and like this video, I would really appreciate that. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye everyone!